I've got a question if you'd hear me out What is up guys welcome back to my youtube channel We will build a neon yellow custom scooter for you guys and give you some tips and tricks on how to put together your scooter First of all, let's go through the scooter parts that we will be using in this custom build First of all, we got a Fasten Brandon Smith signature deck with a blunt standard headset which is already installed Then we got the Ethic Mero HIC fork with a standard HIC shim Then we got the Ethic Vegas titanium bars Then we got the Ethic Zilf aluminium clamp two black pearl wheels, one standard black grip tape, and of course some tennis grips. If you want to know how to spray paint your scooter, make sure you check out my spray paint tutorial, which will be linked down in the description, or just click the annotation somewhere right here. Let's begin, let's put the scooter together. All you need for this are two 5mm Allen keys, one 6mm Allen key, one 30mm grab grab, one carpet knife and maybe a hammer. Let's start off with putting on the grip tape. Make sure that the surface of the deck is 100% clean so the grip tape sticks better to the surface. Start at the corner and peel off the grip tape. Once the grip tape is on your deck, take any piece of metal and slide along the side of your deck. Now take your carpet knife and cut off the grip tape along the side of the deck. Now that the grip tape is successfully installed, let's start with putting on the back wheel. Take the back axle and slide it through the hole. Now take one spacer, then the wheel, then the other spacer. Now take a hammer and hammer through the back axle and tighten your back axle. First of all, you want to put in your headset bearings. In our case, the headset bearings are already installed. So now you want to take your forks, which is in our case, the Ethic Mero HIC fork. This fork right here has an integrated crown race. If your fork does not have this crown race, you will need a separate one and put it on the top and hammer it down to the bottom. Take your forks and slide them through the bottom of your head tube. Take the extra ring and put it over your forks. Now you take the top cap, which is not absolutely necessary. It protects your headset bearings from dirt, dust and water slash woa. It makes your scooter heavier, but in our case, we just use it and put it over your forks. Now take your HIC shim and put it over your forks. Now take your HIC top cap bolt and a 6mm allen key and put it on. Slide. Now it's time to put on the front wheel. You take your axle. Now take your wheel. Now take the fork axle bolt. Take two 5mm allen keys and tighten your front axle. Now you take your bars and your clamp and you slide your clamp over your bars. Boom. Boom. Take your bars and put slash slide them on your forks. Before you tighten your clamp, you want to make sure that the bars are straight. Once the bars are straight, take your allen key and tighten your clamp. When you tighten your clamp, make sure you do not tighten them all at once. Always tighten one bolt and then the other bolt progressively and always switch up. Now take your bar ends and put them on. Just take it and press it in. Uh, Alright. Now it's time to put on your grips. I personally prefer tennis grips. If you want to know how to install tennis grips, make sure you check out my tennis grip tutorial, which will be linked down in the description. Click the annotation right here to find out more. Last but not least, drop test. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed our neon yellow scooter custom build. If you have any questions, please comment them down below. I'm gonna answer all your questions. Please like this video, share this video with a friend, 
and subscribe for three new videos every week. I hope you learned something new. Stay tuned for my next video and see you later. Bye! We will be building Alekis. <laughs> <laughs> now take the fork. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs>